was being filmed. Video, video was video was being filmed. Video was being filmed. That is when shots rang out. Six others were also shot besides this toddler. Now police tell us they do have five people in custody and they are people that now may possibly be charged in this toddler's death and that is what may happen next in this situation. And of course police say they are also keeping an eye on this because they say when this toddler is taken off life support this could potentially set off a gang war between two housing complexes in West Oakland. That is their concern. But from the attorney to the family's pastor and down to the family, everyone says that this all in all is just a very sad and difficult situation. Live in Oakland, Sue Thompson, ABC 7 News. It sure is. Thank you, Sue. San Leandro police believe they've identified an 18-year-old man as the getaway driver in a shooting at Walmart on Black Friday. Detectives consider Curon Foreman of Oakland to be armed and dangerous. Investigators say he may still have the gun that was fired in the shooting. Two other suspects, Tony Phillips and Detuan Watson, remain in custody in connection with the shooting on November 25th. Watson surrendered to a SWAT team yesterday after officers cornered him in an Oakland home. Witnesses say the three men tried to steal a gold chain from another man in the Walmart parking lot. During the robbery, Watson opened fire, striking one man in the neck. Solano County Sheriff's Deputy.